oil. You don't have to specially treat it. It is dishwasher safe. It is oven safe 450 degrees, has the cook and look lid. And this is your final call. So it is your last call, you all, because when you see Adam Freeman with a brand new today special at midnight, you are not getting this. And by the way, uh, Chef, you know I'm a little stinker. The word is out, my oh, secret yeah. sale, over so 200 good. people already pre-ordered on it, so that's gonna be coming up. But Chef, I have to defer to you because the price almost seems too good to be true. I mean, if people haven't called, they're it like, does. what am I missing, right? Well, here's the deal. It looks like that beautiful cast um, iron, right? And it cooks like that beautiful cast iron, but it's much lighter weight. Look at that beautiful lid. Silicon um, uh, lid like that. And then, of course, you get that steamer and roaster tray there. If you want, you can just pop that on and you can use it as a dry, as a, um, a, a strainer um, around the top, whether you're frying or, or grilling. But here's what's so cool. It is cast aluminum, very, very strong pan, but very lightweight. I can literally hang it on my pinky. You get that stainless steel disc. You can use it on induction, on electric, on gas. It's just the perfect pan. You use it for absolutely everything. Now, I'm blanching over here. I'm using that easy lift basket to blanch. Right next door, I'm frying, right? I've been frying my little dumplings, and here's what I do. I pop them up here first to let them drain off a little bit, and then the next batch underneath, I go ahead and I pull those guys up because I let them drain for a little second because you want that oil for two reasons. You want it to drip back into the oil, of course, because you don't want to, oops, that's me being clumsy. You don't want to uh, waste it, but also you don't want it to be greasy, right? So whether you're doing fried chicken, whether you're doing dumplings, it doesn't matter. You go right ahead, you pull these out, you pop another one up. You take that one off, you pop another one up. And that's the system that you end up using and you get these gorgeous little ricotta fritters that are just so delicious all right once you've got all of those out then of course you can go ahead and remove this very very simply i'm just going to grab my tongs and remove that there's one that got away we'll get him out of there as well because i want to show you that easy lift basket it's not just for uh, blanching um, veggies you can also be deep frying in it so i've got some chicken cutlets here that i'm going to drop in in some breadcrumbs so you it's a great fry basket it's a great blanching basket but let's get back to the pan because here are my ribeyes i'm going to eat it with a little bit of pepper a little bit of salt right using my incredible grind is it less than ten dollars a piece by the way when you buy them as a pair for 19.99 and let what well, let me show you these ribeyes these are the pork ribeyes did we sell out of them or do we still have a hundred or so hanging around shannon i'm not, not exactly what? sure Chef, I think so, we got so the last 100 of the auto ship. So the final 100 of the auto gotcha. ship and not much more than that. <laughs> oh, sorry, 50 left in the auto ship. <laughs> and okay. a, a little over 100 in that single ship. Oh, Chef, are you doing some of the fish in that fry basket that we have coming up? What's going on oh. there? No, th this is actually a little, um, this is the pork ribeye oh, that we've rib patted out with a, with a, and then we've gone ahead and, and stuck the crumb on. But I do have gorgeous fish coming up for you. That's the next thing, Shannon, you read my mind. As soon as this is ready, you guys, you go ahead, you give it a little shake. We've put a little foot on there. So if you want, you can rest it over the water and let it drain. While that happens, come with me, Shannon, because you're not just cooking on the stovetop, you guys, with this. You're also baking in the oven. Use your silicon handles. I know there's only a few of you that can still pick up on those, but I tell you what, you really do need them because when you're pulling these, these um, pans out of the oven, red hot, I mean, look at that pasta. Oh my goodness. Now, the cleanup, Shannon, normally it's a mess, but watch this. All I do is I come on in, I wipe this out with a towel. Yes, you can toss it in the dishwasher, of course you can. But look at that, guys. Look like it just wow. came out of the box. It was in the oven for an hour after cooking the sauce for an hour before that. Okay, don't say I didn't warn you. And you <laughs> all are smart. You already started calling on the secret sale fry pan. The secret is out. The black is officially gone in that today's special though. Because so like I said, don't say we didn't warn you. If you want the white, we have fewer than 500 of that white. And the gray is actually, you know, remember how we started the show with about a thousand remaining? 
We are now in the hundreds remaining on that gray. Black is gone, white 500 only, stone gray. We started with a thousand in this show and we're already into the final couple hundred. The reds are our most popular. Here's our classic red, there's our cherry red. I always call this lapis lazuli <laughs> blue, but it's really like a, just a beautiful bright blue. Then we have our slate blue and our turquoise. Remember, it's basically a whole cookware set because this you braise, you bake, paellas, you pop popcorn, you roast a chicken in this. Uh, you can do deep posh the dishes in this. I mean, why not? You do your skillet meals in this. You're frying your chicken tenders. And remember, for $40, just to put the value in perspective, this is my personal, what I call the Goldilocks, the everything pan. We do it once a year. I spent $40 on this at a, as a today's special, and I'd do it again because I love his pans. That is not what you're getting. This is more capacity. By the way, notice that I can lift this even with a couple of fingers, even with my dexterity issues. Deeper walls, deeper capacity, better lid design with that specially designed, tighter fit silicone seal, cook and look, oven safe, dishwasher safe, oven safe to 450 degrees. It is last call. If you want any of these three colors, black already sold out. If you want that gray or white, you need to be calling now. And then the secret sale pan is right around the corner. And you know, the thing is, Chef, I was talking about how we love our cast iron, because you can get it really hot. This is PFOA free. It conducts the heat up the sides. And mm -hmm. that's the thing that's really genius about this. You can overload or you can fill this to capacity and you're still going to get that even heat and conductivity that is second to none. And then the cleanability is not like anybody else, right? Right, oh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, it really is the pan that does everything. So. Here I'm doing a slow cook, right? I've ground my beef. By the way, I'm using that beautiful chopper that as soon as you add your onions, turns into a wonderful spoon. Just one of those four um, nylon utensils. Go check them out online, you guys. So you're doing a slow cook. I'm making a chili, right? Next goes in my beans. Look at the capacity, you guys. That, by the way, is two full cups of beans. No, it's not, it's four cups of beans, I beg your pardon. Four cups of beans. Let's throw in four cups of tomato sauce. Have a look at the size of this chili, and I've still only half filled my pan. You know, that is what we're talking about. You've got a four and a half quart pan coming to you for less than $30. It is just the deal of the century. It won't be repeated. I'm just giving you a fair warning. Have a look at that wonderful, wonderful chili. I removed my spoon. Of course, I want my lid. This is that gorgeous grey that you were talking about. We've got hundreds of these left now, so this will probably be the next one to go. And here's what's so cool. From a slow cook to a sauté right next door. Now, to make sure that that slow cook, uh, that sauté, beg your pardon, is cooked right, let me grab my kinetic thermometer. All you do is give it a quick shake, right? You'll see that temperature come to life right there. I'm going to go ahead and pull that right out. Check the temperature. What we're looking for with pork is about 165 at the minimum. Yep, great. We've cooked it all the way. Don't want to overcook it, so let's get it straight on out. And let me show you the cleanup again. So reach for a pan, for a plate rather. Look, you get that gorgeous colour on both sides. You get it every single time. And that's what we love. That's what we stand by, the perfect results. Because those great results, stainless steel utensils, by the way, no problem. Won't scratch the pan. Grab yourself a towel. I'm reaching for my silicon handle one more time. I'm going to go on in. Give that a real quick wipe out, right? You can see that red hot pan there. Let me show you something even sillier. Let's put some sugar in here and make a caramel because I want you to see that a caramel will not stick to this pan. We know that a caramel is the, um, the, the stickiest thing on the planet, right? But it still won't stick to the pan. Over here, my little uh, pork cutlets are done. So you can see those beautiful pork cutlets are fried. So I'm going to just go ahead, drain those off, and then keep going, Shannon. All right, but here's the problem, Chef. And it's so funny. Mason, <coughs> thank you. Mason had to switch out our beauty set because the black is gone. It's a good thing that that white isn't in there because a the white is going to go next or could be that taupe uh, or that stone gray, rather, because we started this hour with a 1,000 of that stone gray remaining. We are now into the hundreds uh, left. So the thing is, bigger capacity. So here's what's that kind of fun. Now you have to bear in mind, now when I did this at home in the original Goldilocks pan, I ran out of room, to be perfectly honest, because it had smaller sides. So you want to talk about cooking for a crowd? Now, this is after I had already helped myself. <laughs> I helped myself at home, okay? 
So that's after I'd already helped myself at home. But here's the really cool thing. If I want to clean it up, there's no, there's no sink on the set. There's no, okay, that's like, look at, and literally wiping it out. So that's baked on, caked on, and cheese, even on the outer edges. I can just wipe that all off. And I'm telling you, as sure as I'm standing here, if you're cooking for a crowd, if you're cooking for a party of one, if you are looking for your ultimate crowd pleaser, make it this set. And I say set because you bake, you braise, you can broil, you can do a deep saute, you can pop popcorn, you can do your big pasta bakes in this, you can cook for a crowd, you can fry your chicken in this, you can do anything and everything and you can do it only for this show. Because remember, this is your final opportunity. At 12 midnight, you're gonna see Adam Freeman with another brand new today's special. And guess what? You won't get this for this price after this show, after 12 midnight. And chef, no kidding, the price is irresistible. We're getting ready to call the stone gray almost gone. The white is almost gone. You know, as much as I love your cookware, I, I would have to say this is hands down my favorite pan that you've ever done. Would you agree? I thought you were going to say you love me more, Shannon, but that's okay. No, no problem. I understand. People used to stop me in the street and say, I love your show, man, or, hey, I got your book, I love your book. And now people stop me at the farmer's market, they're like, oh, your pans, buddy, your pans. And you know what? I love it, Shannon. It makes me so happy because when I give you one of these pans, when we package it up and send it to you, you know what we're giving you? The gift of cooking. And it's such a special thing. If you have confidence in the kitchen that your food's going to come out right, and if you're sitting around the dinner table with the special people in your life, and if you're sharing those conversations and those beautiful things that food can bring, I mean, that is what it's all about for me. Have a look at this sugar just disappearing from that nonstick cookware. I mean, even a caramel does not, doesn't stick. It's quite unbelievable. Harry called me before, he said, do a caramel in a normal pan and then show everybody. I said, mate, I haven't got time to do two different caramels, but you can see it on my, um, on my stainless steel spoon. Look how it sticks to the spoon, but it won't stick. He's gonna call me again after this and said, I told you to do it in a separate pan. But anyway, sorry, Harry. Look, it's still stuck to the spoon and have a look at the pan. It is literally just gonna bead across the bottom of that, it just like, You've just waxed the car. I mean, yeah, it takes a second because it's a sticky, sticky thing, but you can see how both on the front and the back of the spoon, 100% still stuck, and it's just starting to just slowly move away from the side of the pan. Okay, I'm going to jump into the animation in just a sec, but before I do, I need you to see this gorgeous fish because this is where we're going next, Shannon. I've got one of my fillets of salmon, one of my fillets of cod, and then that gorgeous fillet of flounder as well. I'm going to reach for my turner. I'm going to give them all the space they deserve. Have a look at these gorgeous fish fillets. I mean, just so delicate, so perfect, all within their own ways. We're going to sell you a sampler. You can pick up all three of these beautiful fish in the one delivery. Four salmon, two flounder, two cod. I need you to try it. I've just got to get you to give it a shot because I know, just like so many of you were doubtful when I first brought the salmon, now it's HSN's number one food item, right? Highest rated as well. Look at that gorgeous caramel just beating away from there. Okay, Shannon, I'll shut up. I know you've got to tell them which colors next to sell out. I so do, I'll let you do I that do. while I keep on But okay, not, <laughs> not sugar. That's the pan that we cooked in on the set. In fact, I could put this on our beauty table and no one would know the difference. That's what we did the pasta in. <laughs> That's what my pasta did. You know, none of the cheese, none of the sticky, ooey, gooey, gooey sauce, nothing, not even like a little lick of pasta is left behind. And that was with no dishwasher. That was just wiping it off with a cloth. Let me show you what we have left. And boy, oh boy, are we busy. You're gonna have to act quickly. Strike while the iron is hot because when you see Adam with a brand new today's special at 12 midnight, you are not getting this. Frankly, this was a year and a half in the making. The original Goldilocks, what I call the one of a kind, the little black dress of pans, mine sold right here at a today's special price for $40. This is my pan from home, but you can see, and I love it, but you can see how um, it's much more shallow. So it has a much shallower depth 
to it. Frankly, I didn't even bring in the lid for this just because the, the I didn't want to put shame in anybody's game, but this lid is such a big upgrade and that's because of us and because of you. Chef gave you the best lid design with a tighter silicone fit and seal all cook and look, and then that great little um, uh, cheat uh, hole where you can put that probe in if you wanna use this kinetic thermometer. There's that great elevated tray. So it's basically like a whole set. How much would you spend for a paella pan? How much would you spend for that French enameled cast iron? How much would you spend for a brazing pan? If you put a one in front of that price, that's maybe what you could expect, but no one has the DuraPan coating. We've already sold out of the black. We are poised and ready to stamp that white sold out with fewer than 500. Last couple hundred of that stone gray. Um, we started with a thousand of those gray in this hour. We started with, I think, over 7,000 for the day, and we now have the final 500. So final 500. There's your slate blue. Reds are the most popular, red and cherry red. I call it lapis lazuli, and then the turquoise blue. And chef, that's just it. At the end of the day, if people are looking for a high performance pan, this replaces everything, doesn't it? Oh yeah, I mean, not only your cookware, Shannon, it replaces your bakeware. Look, I baked a cake. I mean, you can't believe that you'd bake a cake in a saucepan, but look at what I've done. By the way, this is big enough to be classified as a stock pot. Look at how the cake falls out. I mean, it doesn't get any better than that, Shannon. Now, of course, you just go ahead and flip this baby back over. You can see that beautiful cake that we've done here. I've made a little ganache right beside it. You could do ganache on one side. You could do caramel on the other. I'm gonna go ahead and take that gorgeous ganache. And ganache, by the way, it's just chocolate and cream as a mixture. I pour that all the way over the top. Let me just, I call it the spoonula for a reason because you can just go ahead and use it as a, as a spatula in the same way you can use it as a spoon, right? So I get that gorgeous chocolate ganache over the top, give it a little bit of a push around, and look at that. You've got a beautiful big chocolate cake that you did with no effort at all. You did that in your cookware. It's not even done in bakeware, which is pretty amazing when you think about how multifaceted you'll get. I'm doing a caramel sauce over here, and then I've got that gorgeous fish that I was showing you before, my cod, my flounder, and of course that beautiful Faroe Island salmon. And look, I've let it go a bit too far, but don't you worry because even in your Durapan, when something goes horribly wrong and something starts to stick or burn, no problem. You just pick it up, give it a slide around, and everything will just slide right on out. It, it will. Hey, Steve, what are we at? 36,000 sold? Okay. Oh, wow. 38,000? Okay, we're almost at 39,000 sold, and you know what? Get it while the getting's good. I mean, more capacity, but it gives you the performance of the highest cast iron on the planet with none of the special cleanup or the obsession or the weight. Get it now, though, because we, we started with 1,000 in this hour, fewer than 500 of that stone gray, fewer than 500 of the white. So those will easily be gone by the end of the hour. Anyway, you stack it. The price goes away at midnight when you see Adam with a brand new today's special. Now, when we started this show, we had more stuff here. <laughs> but the steamer inserts sold out. We do still have...